Jo. Good morning. You sleeping in your bed? Would you like your breakfast? Princess Abby? <laughs> okay. I'm gonna make some rice because Abby likes to have rice in her food. So we'll put on a little pot of rice. And then I'll figure out what I'm gonna eat for dinner tonight. I'm gonna make her food. I gotta figure out what I'm gonna eat. And then I'm gonna pour resin. Then edit. I like to edit four more videos today because we need to edit four videos every day in order for me to get all my videos up and scheduled for the time I'm away so you guys get videos while I'm traveling. Excuse me, are you still sleeping? You don't want to get up? And we'll go down to the beach at some point today. Today is my day off from teaching, dancing, and vending. So it is a YouTube day, resin art day, planning my trip day. I may even bring out my suitcase today to start bringing uh, things from my closet into the suitcase just to see if there's anything I need I can order it or find it in Vegas uh, before my trip so good morning vlog Love. one of my favorite content creators Elise and um, I wanted to share with you something that I think is interesting uh, because rice around the world is different especially different cultures have different rice and I like to mix white rice with brown rice together and then I put it like in a glass jar and I mix it up so this is how I like to eat my rice but um, yeah this is just cowrose rice so it's that sticky rice that you know you can use for sushi but this is the rice that we use in Hawaii so I like to get brown and white and then mix them up together so I have a pot of rice going because Abby likes to have it in her meals so thought I share 40 I have to fix the tops of these so I taped it up and I'm gonna do a top coat which is time consuming and I I mean a lot of artists do top coats and everything but my pieces are nice coming out of the mold but in this case I have to fix certain things on the top of the piece so I'm gonna top coat it to try to cover up what I don't like um, I'm gonna make another trinket tray just in case the one I made sells this weekend I have one for Roseville weekend next weekend and then I'm gonna try working with lavender for the first time I don't know if these are dry hopefully so we'll see all right here we are I did the top coats for these made another trinket tray and I'm kind of testing the waters out with the lavender. I do need to do a back coat to that. So I'll have to do a back coat for this piece, this piece, and this piece. I want to do magnets in this size. So I'll have to come back here in a couple of hours. And then once I'm done with that, I'm not going to come back and pour resin. But yeah, looking forward to see how the lavender turns out and then I just I love the begonias They're absolutely gorgeous and so pretty to work with so I made another piece Got my focaccia bread one slice toasting I'm listening to another podcast that I like to listen to the sip um, And I'm going to use the everything bagel seasoning with Some avocado. I'm gonna have avocado toast for breakfast a fair amount in there a really good seasoning so just waiting for my toast to get a little toasty and then I'll have my breakfast so it is 10 26 in the morning and I just got out of my pajamas have my focaccia toast with avocado and I have a glass of orange juice I do need to go to Trader Joe's probably tomorrow morning so that I can get bread for the weekend for vending. Now that I'm done pouring resin, I'm going to focus on editing four videos. I would like to post some stuff for sale online as well. So that is the agenda. And then when the sun starts setting, 
we'll drive down to the beach so Abby can get her walk. Mm -hmm. Alright, weather's perfect. So I brought out my laptop and I'm gonna edit here. Munchkin's hanging out in the sun. You sunbathing, baby? You're gonna get a haircut soon. Look at that Yorkie face and all that Yorkie hair. Love you, cutie. Okay vlog, it's 1.30. I just finished editing my second video of the day. My goal is to do four and also to plan Zanzibar. And I reached out to a content creator who lives in Zanzibar. So that'd be cool if we can meet be up. pouring the back layers of these pieces. And then I'm going to jump into my third video of the day to edit.
Okay, I brought the Thai constellation out to grab a photo because I would like to print it out and frame it, take it to my new Vegas room. But I'm gonna put it back into the bathroom so it doesn't get burnt. Somebody doesn't want to eat their breakfast, but is uh, always down for a carrot, huh? Okay, we're gonna edit my third video of the day and then we'll see what time it is. We may go to the beach after that or after I edit my fourth video of the day and then, you know, I don't have to worry about editing anymore. I can just focus on planning my trip for the rest of the day when we come back from the beach. So we'll see how quick I can get the third video done. Enjoy your carrot, babe, but mommy wants you to eat your breakfast. But I don't know, lately she, she sometimes wants to eat and sometimes she'll just eat at dinner time when we're back from the beach. You like your carrots? Very good, I know. <laughs> it's a quarter after three and I'm out here editing on the Tiffany Blue table in the patio. I've been editing all day out here because the weather's nice. It's not cold, it's not hot, it's perfect. And I'm working all day from home so I'm trying to give myself a break from being inside my studio. So my goal is to edit one more video because it's still early in the day and once I'm done with my next video which will be the fourth video that I edit for the day then I'll allow myself to step away, take a break, go and take Abby to the beach. The last few days we've been going after 6 for sunset but maybe I'll be able to go down there earlier and then I'll come back and I have to pour another layer of resin and I would like to kind of gear myself up to get ready for vending weekend and also just spend the rest of the night planning for Zanzibar and I need to look for tickets and figure out dates for my trip to visit my friend Diana in Ibiza, my Romanian friend that moved away I don't know when she moved away Two months ago i haven't seen her for two and a half months almost a little over two months so i'm gonna visit her in the fall before i start vending for the holidays so i'll probably go for like two weeks and then come back so i need to figure out dates and flights which i would like to book by tomorrow so that's that it's a long day of just sitting down and working from home and editing because i want all my videos up and scheduled so that when i'm traveling you guys get content every day so while this is rendering i'm going to tidy up the house i just brought in my laundry that i did like a day and a half ago so i need to put that away and then we'll come back and edit my fourth video. Give this vlog a thumbs up. Okay, it's 4.30 and I'm done editing my fourth video of the day. Evie got her necklace on, so I'm gonna change clothes and we're gonna go to the beach so she can get her walk. I can get a workout in and then it like gives me a reset button and then I'll come back and I'll shift gears to like tidying up the house and whatnot, things like that and gearing up for vending weekend also i uh, got in touch with another content creator who's a tour guide for zanzibar island he's a local in case you wouldn't type in why is there why am i losing space right you have to kind of know how the app works to to know what to put in there so that's what the the guide is for okay so because uh we've gotten these calls before i'm done uh, editing four videos poured resin twice and um, it's 5 30. let's do this it's a beautiful day all day i was just like enjoying being able to edit in the patio it's 74 and sunny ebby's been so patient with me i've worked all day from home and now we get to go and exercise i'll be home before the sun sets maybe i can stop by trader joe's on the way home but it's probably really busy right now because it's 5 30 if not i'll go tomorrow morning and i really wanted to go to five o'clock yoga because i haven't gone in person for over a year to my favorite teacher now that he's back open 
but I felt bad that if I go, then oh, there's my crown. Okay, found free street parking right by the Rose Garden. All right, perfect day to be out. Where's the munchkin? Oh, okay. Hey, baby. Good job. Right. Slightly chilly, but we're doing it. Perfect day. Take a look at this. Going back the other way. It's an incline. Whew. Come on, there she goes. Hey, we did it. Perfect day. Look at this. Abby. Good job, baby. <laughs> in the patio and this is the first time i'm trying this this is vegan chicken uh with orange sauce orange sauce and i just sauteed mushrooms in it ideally i would like broccoli but i have mushrooms and i'm leaving in a couple of days so i want to make sure i eat the mushrooms and then the rice that i cooked this morning so let's see how it tastes and then i want to put this on but first let me do a first impression I mean, for it to be plant-based, I kind of even like, I mean, I don't even know how to explain it. It's soft. I don't know if it's like tofu soft, but I'm going to eat it. I'm still trying to find other chickenless vegan options to cook instead of the chopped chicken that I get at my neighborhood grocery store. So I decided that when I seen this at Trader Joe's, I wanted to try it. But next time I buy this orange chickenless tender thing, I'm gonna make sure I get broccoli so I can saute with broccoli. Or sugar snap peas would be good. Mm -hmm. Let's see now. Mm hmm so I'm gonna enjoy now once I'm done eating I think I'm gonna jump in the shower Abby has not eaten all day something's wrong with her I don't know so cheers to another vegan option from Trader Joe's Sin. hey how's it going congratulations aren't these cool your Hoya is just giving you blooms I know I, this Hoya likes me. First season of blooms. Yes. So you have this is going to be your second and third bunch of blooms. This is a great plant. <laughs> okay, thumbs up the video. Shout out to Tristan for driving all the way to Santa Monica with his Hoya crinkle eight that I gifted him. It's giving him blooms, three batches of blooms. So super cool. I'm going to put this under silica gel. We are. I'm going to cover it with silica gel and then I'll check on it and. It maybe two days from now. I'm watching church right now. I just finished cleaning my stir six and cups. I'm gonna pour. 8.30 and I'm gonna have to come back and pour the back layer of this. This was my extra resin. I wasn't planning on doing this. So Yep, pretty happy. Hey, we have a little munchkin. It's just showered with mommy. It's 8.40 p.m. I'm gonna make me a cup of tea. I guess I can edit a fifth video. Then tomorrow I can only just edit three and feel okay. Since it's the day before vending day, I have a lot of prep to do. Like putting earrings together, bookmarks, taking pictures, things like that. So maybe after your bone, maybe you'll decide to eat your one and only meal, which was your breakfast that's been sitting. You have to eat at least one meal after this, okay? I don't know what's wrong with her today. <laughs> 